Come of the aging St. Pete Pier. It's a controversial topic in Pinellas County. The city council is talking about the new lens design all day today. Right now, people are lined up in downtown St. Pete to express their strong feelings about this design, and they are not happy. Our Allison Morrow just stepped out of the city council meeting. She joins us now with more. Allison, you say people are basically protesting this new design. Well, they are, Dia. We are hearing from both sides, but certainly those who do not like the lens design are the loudest today. And here, this sums it all up. This is a cardboard cutout of some of the city council members here. Uh, their eyeballs, as you can see, are the lens design for the pier. And up here is Mayor Bill Foster. And as you can see, he's wearing devil horns. This is a defendant's chair because we are just across this grass here from the Pinellas County Courthouse where some of these civil cases come. And the point of this whole demonstration here is that these city council members and the mayor who support the lens design are basically chained up here as inmates. They are criminals because they're taking taxpayer dollars for a very bad idea. Now take a look at this video just out uh, inside the city council meeting right now. It is filled with people on both sides. Like I said, some who like the lens design are wearing shirts like make lens not war and others who do not like it have shirts on that say uh, stop the lens. And today one of those sides will likely be the winners as St. Pete City Council votes whether to give the first payment of about five and a half million dollars to start construction on the lens design and this is basically the last vote in a long line of votes up to this point uh, when it comes to deciding what this pier should look like so this is also one of the last times uh, for opponents of the lens design to make sure city council knows how much they do not like it if you close the pier down and you try to demolish it I will be there standing in front of the equipment and you will be arresting me every time I get back out of jail. Now, again, we're expecting this meeting, a very heated, emotional meeting uh, with demonstrations just like this to continue all uh, afternoon. We'll bring you the latest at 5 and 6 o'clock. For now, we're live in downtown St. Pete. Allison Morrow, ABC Action News.